you must you must know the basic of linux you must know understand what is ci cd and at least uh, have some knowledge on the uh, cloud platforms so hello everyone and today we have with us mr simit and he is here to share his experience with us so before moving ahead with the interview first of all welcome to our channel mr simit and would you tell us something about yourself um thank you sonia uh, first of all i'm really grateful if you have provided me such opportunity and to your entire team placement interview so thank you for having me here and my name is sumit rawat as you mentioned and i've recently graduated in last year 2021 from nid bhopal from the mechanical engineering and uh, currently working in wipro as a devops engineer So this role is basically uh, my full time role which I got from my on campus placements during my final year. So would you tell us something about the company Wipro you are currently working with? Okay so uh, Wipro is like a um, uh, MNC and uh, it provides some consultation and services as we know in the field of IT and um, most of you uh, must be knowing wipro uh, by the name it's a server ba- service based company and it hires from like many colleges so uh, most of you will be familiar with this name and um, so it caters to like different kind of projects uh, it takes a banking projects medical insurance and um, it also takes some uh, projects from big companies like um, apple microsoft google so yeah that's about wipro So as you know, there are the responsibilities in every profession we talk about. So what does your day look like? What do you do in your day-to-day basis? So let's just talk about your profile specifically. Okay. So um, I am in a banking project basically, and my role is a DevOps engineer. So I usually work in a UK shift. So. Uh, my roles and responsibilities are uh, in general uh, that's common to every devops role we have so like it's maintaining the server taking care of the deployments and uh, troubleshooting uh, supporting the development teams and all the tools we use maintaining them uh, ensuring that they are we are using the latest versions we don't have any issues and yeah th- these are the common uh, day to day activities we perform okay So as you mentioned, it was a campus placement. So how was the question and the process handled? Uh, so which is about the process to have that you did? Yes. So uh, as far as I remember correctly, so it was basically a three rounds of interview, and uh, basic um, first round goes with the basic <clears throat> aptitude questions, and the second was a kind of technical interview. So uh, it was not directly for DevOps. It was in general hiring, and later on I was uh, given for the DevOps project. Uh, but uh, I hope that most of you uh, would be curious to know what kind of questions in general DevOps uh, engineers are asked. So it's uh, like basic CI/CD operations. You must know what is CI, what is CD. You must know the tools, uh, GitHub, Jenkins, Ansible we use in uh, day-to-day activities. So and uh, it's good to uh, know some cloud. So basically, you are talking about some of the skills, right? So skills are really very important in shaping any profession. So for becoming a DevOps engineer, what are the basic skills that should be present in the one? Yes. So uh, as I already mentioned, so dev- skills uh, on a high level, I would say uh, it goods. It is good to have uh, at least one of the cloud skills, maybe it with AWS, uh, GCP, or Azure, and. Uh, GitHub is very common. You must know GitHub or SVN. So these are the uh, source control tools, and uh, you must know um, Ansible. You must know some CI tools, okay? And that is Jenkins. Uh, nowadays, Circle CI, Bamboo is also gaining popularity. So these CI tools and some CD tools. So these all uh, basic things. And uh, one uh, one more uh, basic elements like that is Linux. So Every day, all the uh, servers are Linux servers, basically, which we use in our day-to-day operations. So one must know uh, Linux as well. Okay. So for the technical skills that you mentioned, can you give us some of the resources or platforms that will be helpful for the audience and who wants to take their career further in the DevOps engineering field? 
okay so uh, resources is like uh, probably uh, you can find everything in youtube and if you go if you want it to be in more sequential order so you can uh, take some udemy courses uh, it may be with mumsad mohammad and uh, many other courses which even i have referred to for my uh, cloud skills so that is good resource and even um, you can read through the number of articles which we have these days linkedin is also um, having lot number of articles which are shared on daily basis so you can refer those for your learning so thank you so much sumit and lastly do you want to give any advices to our future aspirants who wants to join the same role as yours okay so uh, if you are willing to uh, work as a devops engineer so yeah devops is of course gaining popularity these days slowly and steadily and uh, it's a, it has a high demand definitely in the future so uh, my advice would be like uh, you must you must know the basic of linux you must know understand what is ci cd and at least uh, have some knowledge on the uh, cloud platforms so with these three basic cons- these basic three constituents um, you can easily crack a good job in the devops so what has been your experience overall tell us something about your journey with working as in this company and in gen so uh, of course this is my first company wipro and uh, it's been like an year so i'm i'm able to, i'm uh, close to complete an year in wipro and the journey has been really great so uh, when i joined wipro it was like a service based company so uh, the mentality or the taboo is like it will be a more of a support project or anything but uh, definitely not in my case uh, it was full of learning i learned the devops from scratch uh, in wipro so yeah uh, it was really good for me and the journey was really amazing so thank you so much mr sumit for joining in with us today it was amazing talking to you and we wish you a very best of luck for your future from our team placement interview and for the audience if you want to join him then the links will be in the description box below of his linkedin you can connect with him and ask him questions related to this field so thank you so much sumit and would you like to say something at the end no it was a pleasure talking to you and uh, uh, thank you again for having me here so the team is really doing great the placement interview and uh, all the best to you as well thank you <laughs>